Hello, this is Lover of Ladies, and welcome to my channel. On this episode, I'm going to be playing Detroit Become Human. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Good evening. Welcome to the Detroit Experience. Um, good evening to you as well. Thank you. Wait. Are you sure you should continue? Yeah, why? Maybe... Maybe we should leave things as they are. Why? Is there something you're not telling me? Yeah, I want to continue. As you wish. Are you good? This game is freaky. Like... For a second, she made me question whether or not I should continue this game. Like, <laughs> whoa, okay. Wow, that house is burnt. Okay, okay, so this is where the guy lives. Of course he has a truck. I'm not even surprised. He looks like a truck guy. Who's watching me? You've been gone for two weeks, so the place is a mess. You do the housework, the washing, you cook the meals, and you take care of... God damn it, where the fuck's the brat gone now? Wow. Alice! Alice! Oh, there you are. That's Alice. You look after her. Homework, bath, all that crap. Got it? Yes, Todd. Get started down here, then you do upstairs. So you mean to tell me all this time I was gone? Your lazy ass didn't do shit? Alright, let's go wash them dishes. Yeah. Ah. Maybe. Depends on okay. Ah, of course the dishwasher's not working. Yeah, yeah. Great. Now I have to do things by hand. Uh, okay. Let's go. I'll bring it tomorrow. I'm playing a video game where I'm washing dishes, man. Like... I wanted to play a game where I can escape from the real world, not be in a video game version of the real world. Damn, that's mad dishes! I wonder what she's thinking about, Alice. Hey, kiddo. You okay? Hmm. Okay. I don't know if it's because of the fact that I'm a robot. I don't know. Okay. Okay. I get it. Really? <sighs> this, this command is confusing to me, but whatever. Oh, okay, that's how you do it. Kara! Yes, Todd? Bring me a cold beer! Right away. Why can't you get yourself, fat ass? This is what I can't. Anyways. Just imagine if I was a robot. <laughs> I would never. Alright, here's your beer. Okay. I'm literally... Let's get the trash bin, I guess. There you go. Alright. Let's, uh, collect all this trash that he left out in the open. 
probably has some cockroaches in that house. Clean kitchen. Ah, right here. I don't enjoy the idea of playing a video game where it has me clean. Like, I'm done. It's annoying. Yeah, I guess pizza's the only thing he eats. Seeing that there's so many boxes of it. Honestly, though, if I ever have a robot assistant, I would actually still clean along with them. I don't... I wouldn't really have them do everything. I mean, that's just me, though. What is this? Credit card application form? Yo, he owes a lot of money! Wow, he was a lot of money. Okay. I mean... That's suspicious. How is it that he's able to afford a robot assistant, but he's in so much debt? Fuck, man. Alright, let's go. What the hell's going on? I swear to God. Is that his crack pipe? I've made a good start down here. I'll head upstairs. Do what you have to do, but stop bothering me. Okay, die. Next. Yo, he's really getting high. Wow, that's sad. That is so sad. What's this? And now to sports. First up, basketball. As the gears prepare for the critical match with Denver tonight. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, this is cute. Another 225,000 jobs were lost for the U.S. economy in October, according to the Department of Labor, bringing the unemployment figure up to 37.3. Oh my god, are we in Corona too in this game? Crazy. He takes pills? Antidepressant. Oh lord, of course. <gasps> and he has a gun. My daddy's got a, my daddy's got a gun, my daddy's got a gun, you better run. Yo, the bathroom's nasty. But, anyways, how are you gonna have the toilet halfway across the second floor? Like, that's bad architect right there. Man, she's doing mad chores, most I've ever done within a week at this point. Like, this is mad work. Alright, are we done? Hey girl, how you doing? Anyways, let's go. That cheap ass mop. That mop looks hella cheap. Alright, let's go to... the girls' room. Right? I just want to tidy up your room a little. I only need two minutes. Is that okay, Alice? Okay, she's nice. I mean, honestly, just not. Alice in Wonderland. 
Wow. How fitting. Of course. Oh! Sweet. Alright, let me see here. What else do I need to do? I like your fort. It's so cool. She has a cute little bed. Let's air out this room so you can get some fresh air. Yes. Alright, let's see what she's doing. That is a cool fort. Look at that. She has the lights, shelves. I wish I could do that in my room. That's dope. Alright, so am I all set? I see she's an artist. That's cute. I like her imagination. Seems you like reading. Reading's good, honey. It helps. It really does help. Five minutes a day, reading can definitely help with your mind. Damn, you're nosy. Chill out. I'm sure we used to be friends before I was reset. Maybe we can be friends again. Your father said you chose my name. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Kara, it's nice. I like How it. You choose it. You're very quiet. I hope I don't scare you. You should tell me about yourself. What you like to do, where you like to go, your favorite foods. That would really help me. Yeah, I want to get to know you. You're Oh. Oh, where are you going? What did you give me? What is this? A key? <gasps> wow! Okay. Let's open up the box. See what's inside. Alright, I'm ready. Opening up the Pandora box at this point. Okay, cute. Four leaf clover. All right, for good luck. Okay, so that's the dad, the mom, and Alice. Huh. What happened to the mom? I just realized that. What's this? Okay, so just like in heavy rain, this kid has PTSD, I can tell. Like, crying girl with clearly a head injury since there's blood. This game is so freaky. Okay, so that's supposed to be the dad. Oh, <gasps> wait a minute. I just realized the girl is Alice. Oh my god, don't tell me. So, he hits the robot. Which makes sense as to why she was out for two weeks. Oh, nah, he didn't just hit her. He ripped her apart. Bastard. Wow. So that's what happened. Wow. Okay. So I'm dealing with a psychopath. That's cool. What are you doing? Uh, I'm playing. You're playing? Yeah, she's playing. I know what you're thinking. You think your dad's a low life? Uh, she hasn't even said anything. 
Can She's not saying down. anything like that, bro. Don't Calm you down. To make things work? You're just talking to yourself at this point. But whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up. Bro, why are you taking it out on her? You're assuming stuff. You hate me, don't you? Put her down. Put her down. Put her down. You're scaring her. Put her down. What's wrong with you? What am I doing? Being a psycho, that's what you're doing. I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Bro, take your pills. Go to therapy. You're scarring her. Like... Now I know why Alice is quiet, like... Oh my goodness... <sighs> it's a tough situation to be in, to be honest, but... I don't know... It's messed up... Alright, let's see what's next... I admit, this place is so clean. I've never seen anything like it before. It's so peaceful, too. And I just love... Like I said in the last video, fall's my favorite season. So I just love seeing the leaves. Oh, shit. This is a nice house. I bet it's a pain in the ass to clean, though. Time for me to wake up Carl. E, I'm not really feeling the rug per se. But it's whatever. It's a really nice painting. I like that. Okay. Rise and shine. Uh. Good morning, Carl. Good morning. It's 10 a.m. The weather is partly cloudy. 54 degrees. 80% humidity with a strong possibility of afternoon showers. It sounds like a good day to spend in bed. <laughs> Same. But I guess go what? Pick up the paint that you ordered. Oh, yes, I've forgotten. That is the difference between you and me, right, Marcus? You never forget anything. Show me your arm, please, Carl. No. Carl. Behave. Thank you. There you go. Is that? I just opened my eyes and I'm already gritting my teeth. <laughs> All right, buddy. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, this is such a fragile machine. They break down so quickly. All this effort to keep them going. I'll take you to the bathroom now. Come on, buddy, let's go. You ready? One, two, upsie daisy. Come on. We got this. Thank you for trusting me, Carl. All right, buddy. I like his room. It's pretty dope. Ugh, not that. I'm good. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's. Anything special on the agenda today? Yes, there's the opening of your retrospective at the Museum of Modern Art. Mm. The gallery director left four messages asking to confirm your attendance. Are you going? I haven't decided yet. Mm. We'll see about that later. Okay. What well. Else? Just your usual fan mail. I've already answered. Hmm. All right, let's go. Any news from Leo. Leo. No. Um. I can call him if you like. No. No, I don't bother. Okay. Who's Leo? Huh. All right, let's go. I'm starving. Well, your breakfast is ready. Bacon and eggs, just the way you like them. Thank I you. wish I had bacon and eggs. I wish I had someone cooking for me. I'm about to get me a robot. Shoot. 
that is a big kitchen. You know, if my roommate had a kitchen like this, he would be going bonkers because he loves cooking. And currently our kitchen is pretty small, but if our kitchen were ever to be this size, he'll be in this 24-7, like I can tell. Alright, let's go. Come on. Aw, I like the little cup with the smiley face. That's my cup. Alright, let's go. Alright. Time to eat, Aquaman. Yum, 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 yum. Thank you, Marcus. Anytime, bro. Television. Some coffee for you. Use your napkin. Just in case if you get dirty. Why don't you find something to do while I finish my breakfast? Sure. Okay, mm -hmm. bet. Okay, Carl. What can I do? You know what? I'm gonna read a book. Let me see. Shakespeare, Plato, Keats Oates. Um, I'll do Shakespeare. What's in... What's in the shelf? What are you reading? Uh, Macbeth. It's one of the books you recommended. So, what do you think? Crazy. Human emotions are intriguing. Though, I can't really say that I fully understand them. Humans don't understand them either. Hmm. They rule our lives and we have no idea why they make us feel like beggars or kings. Life without emotions wouldn't be worth living. I like that. That's a good quote. One day I won't be here to take care of you anymore. Oh, You'll have damn. to protect yourself. And make your choices. Decide I feel like... I feel like that's a fo become. a foreshadow in this some way. This world doesn't like those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone tell you who you should be. Okay. Let's go to the studio. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> I really feel like that's foreshadowing. Because why would he just say that all of a sudden? Like, that's suspicious. I don't know. Maybe I'm just paranoid. Okay. All right. So what Let's are see you? Where we left off. What are you painting? Remove the sheet. Hmm. Okay. Well, in that case, I'm gonna go and clean the studio. I yeah, met his art is pretty dope. Like, and he sculpts too. What can he, what can he do, besides not walk? But anyways, I bet he makes mad money being an artist. I mean, like he has a gorgeous house, and all he does is paint and sculpt. Like, I like his tattoos. They're pretty dope. So, what's your verdict, Marcus? I love it. I love the shades yes, of blue. There is something about it. Mm. Something I can't quite define. I guess I like it. The truth is, I have nothing left to say anymore. Okay. Each day that goes by brings me closer to the end. I'm just an old man clinging to his brushes. Carl. But enough about me. Let's see if you have any talent. Hmm. Give it a try. Try well, painting something. 
You want me to paint? paint? What I... Painting what? Anything you want. Hmm. Give it a try. <sighs> wow. I'm actually excited. Okay. Hell yeah, let's paint. Okay. What am I going to paint? Why? I guess... Imitation is, fl is flattery, I guess, but... It would be nice if you paint something that you thought of. That is a perfect copy of reality. The painting is not about replicating the world. It's about interpreting, improving on it, showing something you see. Hmm. Carl, I don't th think I can do that. It's not in my program. I... Go on, go. Try it. Grab that canvas. Okay. I mean, he is right. Paint something that you Do see. For me. Close your eyes. Close your oh. eyes. Okay. Trust me. Trust the process, bro. Trust me. Try to imagine this. something that doesn't exist, something you've never seen. Now concentrate on how it makes you feel and let your hand drift across the canvas. Okay. All right, let's see. I want that one. All right. Trust the process. Draw what you see. Trust the process. Draw what you see. Trust the process. Draw what you see. You got this. Man, I can't wait to see what he created. Oh, okay. That's dope. God. The fact that an android did that. Who are you? Who are you, bro? Hey, Dad. Okay. Leo? That's Leo. I didn't hear you come in. Oh, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. Mm. It's been a while, right? What do you want? You all right? You don't look so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> hey, listen, uh, I need some cash, Dad. Wow, that's okay. why you see your old man for money. What happened to the money I just gave you? Yeah, he's not. He's not a bank, bro. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No, no, no. I swear it's not that. No, uh, don't lie to me, Leo. What difference does it make? I just need some cash. That's all. You need to calm Sorry. down. Don't talk to your dad like that, the bro. Is no. What? Why? You know why. You're on that. Whatever you're on. Yeah. Yeah, I think I do know why. <laughs> you'd rather. You'd rather take care of your uh, plastic toy here than your own son, right? No, it's the other way around. I take care of your dad. Life. Smarter, more obedient, not like me, right? But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine! Leo, that's enough! Seriously, bro? Enough. You done? You don't care about anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. You've never loved anyone. You never loved me, Dad. You know, whatever you're projecting is how you feel. You never loved me. It's the other way around. You never loved your dad. You're just mad because he's not giving you money, so... Whatever. Hey, bro, listen. He's cracked. He's a crackhead, bro. Don't take it to the heart, man. Okay, well, this is the end of this episode's Detroit Become Human. Thank you for watching this video. This is Lover of Ladies. Stay safe, take care, and I'll see you next time.